Hello and welcome to Starfleet Academy. Let's see what kind of disasters we can get into today. Let's go for it. Okay. Great conference. Very... Look, is it life? Forrester. Oh, it's Forrester. Nagia may buy your story, but I don't. Why do you really want to join the Vanguard? Captain Kirk convinced me. He discovered the Klingons were behind the attacks on Bicea. But the Federation Council threatened to strip him of command if he went public. And the mysterious alien ship? Stirk and I fabricated some evidence. You helped capture Faith oh. Gage. That was personal. She nearly killed one of my crew. I'm picking up a memory from eight years ago. Diarrhea. A Lieutenant Alan Forrester, his uncle, was killed by a Klingon bird of prey. The colony was later awarded to the Klingons, just like Vicia. His belief in our cause is quite strong. He certainly hides it well. I'm better at playing Starfleet's game than you are. Where do we go from here? We. <laughs> we do nothing. Devolution Day begins in less than one hour. Devolution Day? Magia. It will be the end <laughs> of the Federation as we know it. <laughs> but... Oh, you'll know when it's time. But when it's over, we'll be able to place Kirk in power as the ideal leader of the new Federation. Good idea. Okay, then we'll go for the first one. We play along. <laughs> Why wait? Kirk believes in your cause so much he might join. Are you serious? No. You know him that well? Mm, I don't know. How long would you need? Uh, I can have Kirk here in a few hours. You have one hour. That's the deadline. You better be able to deliver, Forrester. Oh, I will. Stop the countdown. Why? We don't want to incinerate Kirk on his way over, do we? Go ahead. Use this to give Kirk your message. Mm. It's an old style um, communicator. Yeah. Magia. I forgot about all this. <laughs> we have to wrap this up, don't we? It's been nearly an hour. Where's Kirk? Don't worry, he'll come. We've given him enough time. I told you, he'll be here. I'm not waiting any longer. Give me that. I'm restarting the countdown. It's the final countdown. Hey, he is. Main man. Main dude. I hear there's a group willing to take on the Klingons. <laughs> you suckers. Kirk's gonna bust your ass. Yeah. Well, it's an honor, sir. Of course it is. Get to the point. What's your plan? We've set bombs in the offices of key Federation officials. Once they're gone, we're ready to step in to restore order immediately. Okay, that's sir, crazy. you will be presiding over the new Federation. You better have planted those bombs well. Federation security is no joke. Let's see your layout. Show everything. Incendiary bombs planted in public areas near Starfleet security. Planetary defenses and the Federation Council. Detonation in less than one hour. Very thorough, Mr. Malak. Thank you, Captain. Now yeah, you're Nick. You want to know what we're fighting for? A future. The galaxy is filled with murdering Klingons. No one has the courage to stop them. More unaligned worlds brutalized by Klingon forces. I say, enough! You are the new blood that will stand up to interstellar barbarians. Uh, I, should I just try and tro stop the countdown? Let's try and stop the countdown rather than trying to defuse the bombs by burning out the timers. That could be a bit of dodgy. Ever since the Organian Peace Treaty, the Federation has been a wolf with no fangs. Hostile aliens nip like dogs at our heels. And what do we do? Nothing. Every day of peace <laughs> brings us closer to Busted. the end of the Federation. Forrester's betraying us. It's all right. It's just stop the countdown. I can restart it. Kill him. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Oh, 
Oops. That's the end of the game. Okay, what I'm going to do, I'll, I'll replay this at the end of the video, but we'll do the other ending. So we can load that again. Okay. You help. Where do we get to? Why wait? Okay, here we go. We're back here, are we? Yeah, we're going to try and defuse the bombs by burning out their timers. Should that work? It should work, isn't it? Ever since the Arganian Peace Treaty, the Federation has been a wolf with no fangs. That worked, wouldn't it? Hostile aliens nip like dogs at our heels. Or does what he get do killed do? no matter what? Nothing. Uh oh, Every think... day of peace brings us closer to the end of the Federation. Forrester's betraying us. Traitors oh, no. are trying to blow out their timers. Fake voice yeah. again. Give me the phaser now. Put it down slowly. But what slowly. Down? Back up against the wall. Alien dies first. Stop. Oh, please, don't tell me you're a traitor, too. Forrester lied to you. But he betrayed me first. If you want me to be your new leader, his punishment is my call, not yours. Yeah, go full for it. Full for it, yes. kid. Yes, Captain. Yeah, dumbass. This is a better ending. This isn't set to kill. It isn't? No. It's set on wide angle stun. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, you busted. He's got the shits as well now. Huh? Okay. security. Need a security detail beam to this location. Busted. That stun wasn't nice very effective. Nice work in those bombs. Yeah, this time. <laughs> now, I don't know about you, but I could use a drink. Have you ever tried Sully and Brandy? Oh, man, that's a bit harsh, wasn't it? At the end of the first time round, it's just like, well... If you make the wrong... You don't even know if it is actually the wrong choice. It's amazing. Oh, but up to life. been happening, I still have to prepare to graduate from Starfleet Academy. Oh, yeah. I'm alive now, aren't I? Yeah, let's finish off the simulation now we're still alive. <laughs> Stark and I had better finish our simulations quickly. This is not good. Even the Universal Translator is stumped. Interesting. The McClanty Matrix only seems to respond if we mimic its cybernetic patterns. It's as if the McClanty are sentient, but have no real language. It could be an autonomic function, but not real sentience. They could be like cosmic parrots, like mimics. Parrots do not build spaceships. We must what? keep trying. And this is still spaceships. Cadet's log. Well, looks like I'm still in the Academy. There were times I thought I'd blown it, but... And now I think I've made the right choices after all. Do I not get to graduate? Speaking of choices, I spent a lot more time on the simulation than on my class studies. I might not graduate first in my class, but oh. I just felt that Sturk and I were too close to an answer to give up. Yeah, it's more important. Don't need to be top of the class, do you? All known sentient creatures are neurologically wired to use language. But the McClanty appear to have no language in any conventional sense. But we get a clear response when we mimic its actions. True, but irrelevant. But you said there were old pathways and new pathways. Why would that be unless it were changing? Or maybe, well, let's try this. It's gonna blow up in its face, isn't it? Passing it. Oh my God. We did it! We did it, Strick! We did what? Enter!
Our gentlemen, please explain your findings. Okay. Earlier, we concluded that the McClanty are not conventionally sentient and cannot comprehend a spoken language. However, we have now determined that they can learn. We can't make the McClanty follow human thinking, so we have to try to follow their thinking. By mimicking the McClanty ship's every move, a Federation ship can establish a rapport. Hm. Intriguing ideas, but I find it impossible to think that any crew would attempt to try such a radical theory. So don't feel too badly if it's never actually tested in the field. Uh, still, uh, you do deserve some sort of commendation for such a Yay. unique graduation thesis. Uh, dismissed, cadets. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. And with that, that, the door closed on a year's work. Time for the final mission before graduation. Oh god, we've got one more mission. Okay, I'm gonna save that as a backup. One more mission? Okay. Good morning, cadets. We have a crisis on our hands. Oh crap. Small Klingon fleet has crossed the Federation border, uh -oh. composed of at least one heavy cruiser and three birds of prey. Uh -oh. They have openly defied our treaty by destroying three Federation freighters, What's the last near New Danube 4. There are two Federation colonies in that sector as well, Omega Altair and Proxman. The Klingons deny any fleet action and are dismissing the reports as propaganda. Starfleet security thinks it may be a precursor to a larger invasion. Hmm. The USS Alexandria and the USS Rutherford, two Miranda-class vessels, will rendezvous with you at New Danube 4 to conduct both patrol and intelligence missions. You will be in command of this task force. Use it wisely. Captain's log, stardate 4990.5. A Klingon fleet has crossed the neutral zone and has attacked Federation shipping. Starfleet has ordered the Paris to lead a task force to repel this incursion into Federation space. Course laid in, Captain. Give me promotion to Admiral. I'm commanding the fleet. Maybe Fleet Admiral. Let's get ready for combat. Okay, I think we're ready. Warp speed. Hopefully this is going to be the final mission. So this is going to be an extra long episode, but... Silly beat. Get a yellow alert. Entering New Danube system. I'm Another receiving set. messages from the USS Rutherford and the USS Alexandria. On okay. This is Captain Brentwood of the USS Alexandria. Dork. We're at your disposal, Captain. <laughs> this is Captain Zora of the USS Rutherford. We await Zora. your command. Kune. Okay. Captain, I'm receiving a distress signal from the Telluride freighter Kasdan in the Chancellor system. They are being attacked by a Klingon bird of prey. Course laid in, Captain. Yeah, okay, get okay. Red alert. Do I have to hail the other? F this is Captain Brentwood of the USS Alexandria. We're at your yeah. disposal, Captain. Uh, okay, same same stuff. Uh oh. Never Alexandria. Proceed to the Chancellor system. Yeah. Aye, sir. Captain, the USS Alexandria has warped to the Chancellor system. They should That's arrive a in a few minutes. Ascending the. This um... is Captain Zora of the USS Rutherford. We await Sending your command. Everybody. Get your ass to Rutherford, the. Rutherford, proceed to the system. Chancellor system. The course is being laid now. Your instructions shall be obeyed. Rutherford oh. out. Uh -oh, Captain, the USS Rutherford has warped to the Chancellor system. They should so arrive wait. in a few minutes. Okay. Three ships against one bird of prey should be enough, shouldn't it? Unless it's Entering a all-out war. System. Am I doing this right? Captain, the Omega Altair 4 colony reports that it's under attack. A Klingon bird of prey has turned away from attack. They refuse to answer our hails, Captain. Oh, fucking man. Port side shields are Captain, the Proxman 3 colony reports that it's under attack. Hang on. Prepared. Have we got Proxima Free? Oh, Christ, have we got somebody else under attack? Uh, where's the freighter? Captain, I'd rather not draw attention to us during your battle. Watch that. Stand by. That's Sandy Alexandra to help somebody else. This is Captain Brentwood of the USS Alexandria. We're at your disposal, Captain. I think another colony is under attack. Yeah. Uh, proceed, proceed to Omega to... Altair, Alexandria. Aye, sir. Captain, the USS Alexandria has warped to the Omega Altair system. Thank you. Rutherford. I'm gonna send this you is to the Zora other place. Captain Zora of the USS Rutherford. We uh -huh. await your command. Uh huh. Rutherford, Go to box. The course is being laid now. Your instructions shall be obeyed. Rutherford out. I think I can handle this bird of prey here. USS Rutherford has warped to the Proxman system. They should arrive in a few minutes. Good. Right. That's gonna confuse the bird of prey. That's the civilian freighter. Where is this? 
there he is. There he is. There he is. Come here, you bitch. Forward shields repaired. Oops, sorry, wrong button. Upper shields have been hit. Ah, uh, where are you? Where are you? Upper shields repaired. Ah, come back here, you coward. And the hell, this coward. They refuse to answer our hails, Captain. Well, fuck them. Okay, good. Nobody else here. Right. I think I've done the right thing. I think I, I can handle this better place, so I can send it the other ships in the other systems. Hopefully I can handle whatever's happening in it, those systems. Upper shields have been hit. Forward shields have been hit. Forward shields repaired. Got him hard. I got him. Actually, I'm hitting hard. It's only rather sexual. Yeah, get some. Get some. Love those torpedoes, don't ya? Get some more. Oh. How we doing? Yeah, get some. Yeah, I love it. You feel like talking yet? Where's this guy gone? Okay, stand by. There he is. Whoa. Can I hail him? They Surrender. refuse to answer our hails, Captain. Then die. I was about to crash into him. Shit. I oh, know, he's on my six. Love it. Bye bye. Night night. Mm -hmm. okay. Beep beep beep. Hail them. They refuse to answer our hails, Captain. <sighs> Dickheads. Just stay yeah, come on. What are you gonna do? Nothing. Nothing. You're dead in space, you're not going anywhere. What's that damage report? Forward shields online. Oh, shields are. How bad are those shields? 100%, but it's not. 100% if you're not know I me. Mean. Okay, let's go to warp. Was that a mission? I should have checked before I went to warp. Damn it. Entering Omega Altair system. Roger that. Captain, a Klingon bird of prey is decloaked near Omega Altair 4 and is heading towards us. Aha. Uh -huh. Where is it? Can we have them? Light cruiser? It's a light cruiser, it's not a bird of prey. Forward shields repaired. Hail the cruiser. Hail the cruiser? No? Not gonna do that? Okay, hail Omega 3. Most of the colony's communications are down. Okay, I'll continue okay. to monitor it. As long as those signals remain active, we'll know that someone's still alive. This guy's fast. Got another starship in the system as well, haven't we? Terra. Hell, they have a. I don't know. Starboard shields have been hit. Lower shields have been hit. Lower shields have been hit. Lower shields down to 50%. Ah. I was going to send the Alexandra to another. the other star system, the one we just came from, just in case, but. Okay, I don't want to get confused what, what ship Starboard is at what shields system. Repaired. Forward shields repaired. It's a mega old tower. I sent the other ship to Proxima, didn't I? I don't think we've got time. Yeah, you love it. 
Close. I think we crashed into him. That didn't sound good. Shit, shit, shit. Lower shields online. I know. I think we're alright. It's still coming up as red. But I don't see any. Our shields look okay. Is it the lower shields? Are... Okay, he's got a walk. I forgot to check our mission. God damn it. What's our, our mission supposed to be? Entering Proxman system. Okay. This is where we've got another starship. Okay, can we, have we got time Captain, to check? A Klingon bird of prey has decloaked near Proxman 3 and is heading towards us. Okay, let's go see hello. Hello. You're not going to respond? Hail them again? Hail the convoy. More shields I'm still picking up shortwave transmissions, but no one has access to some space communications. There's a lot of panic in the Captain. Starboard shields repaired. That's good. They look alright. What was that? What the hell's that? Was that the Rutherford shooting? Oh, it's the planet. Okay, let's get away from that. I'm in the gravity well. Don't want to I don't want to go down in a blaze of glory. Have I got time to... No, I haven't. Uh, have I got time to Lower check? Shields have been hit. Starboard shields have been hit. Starboard shields repaired. Okay, let's head this way and quickly check to see... What Lower shields repaired. Our mission is determine the reason for killing that activity. Protect the colony. We haven't determined the reason. Can we? Upper shields have been hit. I know. I know. Lower I know, shields I know, have been hit. Starboard shields have been hit. God Upper damn it! Repaired. Forward shields have been hit. What? If they're not talking, how can Forward I find out what they're repaired. going on about? Oh. Could get closer to the Rutherford, I suppose. Lower shields have been hit. Upper shields have been hit. Lower shields have been hit. Lower shields repaired. Forward shields repaired. How is the buffer? Lower shields have been hit. Forward shields have been hit. Whoa. Kamikaze on me. I went kamikaze. I didn't want to crash into them again. I've lost so many ships doing that. I come straight Lower at shields you. Shields repaired. Lower shields repaired. There you are. Lower shields repaired. Oh shit! Wrong button. Wrong button. I was trying to get comfortable. That's not good. Yes. He crashed. No, he's not. He's not going to cloak. I think he's got his ship damaged. Where is he? Ah. Okay, that's bringing us to a stop here. Lower shields online. Can we hail the colony? I'm still picking up shortwave transmissions, but no one has access to subspace communications. There's a lot of panic on the planet, Captain. I'm surprised. There's a lot of shit going down. So, determine the reason for Klingon activity. How do we do that? Did the Rutherford find anything out? This is Captain Zora of the USS Rutherford. We await your command. Do you know anything that's going on? The Chancellor system? Rutherford, yes. proceed to the Chancellor system. The course is being laid now. Your instructions shall be obeyed. Rutherford out. Captain, the USS Rutherford has warped to the Chancellor system. They should arrive in a few minutes. Okay. Watch that. Uh... Did I send the Rutherford to the... Okay, this is Alexandra. What? Did they have any information? This is Captain Brentwood of the USS Alexandria. We're at you... your disposal, Captain. Do you know what's going on? Uh, Never mind, Alexandria. Never mind. Aye, sir. Yeah, we have to do a damage report.
Lower looking shields good. repaired. We're looking good. Okay, let's warp speed. We took a lot of damage though, didn't we? I said something about Lysa pulling down, but... Entering the Chancellor system. Okay, this is where we sent the other ship as well, so we've got back up here. Do we have anything here? How does Philium Freighter, do they know what's going on? I am Kalsa, captain of the Kazdan. We are quite grateful for your assistance. These Klingon barbarians have no respect for life or for lawful commerce. A uh, pleasure to assist you. Thank you. Captain, we did notice something peculiar about that ship. There was an odd subspace transmission being beamed to the bird of prey from the Delta Lyra system. You may be able to use your sensors to track it. Oh. Now, if you'll excuse us, Captain, we have a great many repairs to make, and I'm anxious to leave this system as soon as possible. Course laid in, Captain. Delta. Okay. That's how the other ships. This is Captain Brentwood of the USS Alexandria. You look We're at up, your disposal, they? Captain. <laughs> can you go to... Oh, return to the battle group. That Alexand sounds... Aye, sir. Captain, the USS Alexandria has warped to the Chancellor system. They should arrive in a few minutes. Roger that. That's Rutherford. This is Captain Zora of the USS Rutherford. We await your command. Back here. Proceed to Omega Altair. Rutherford, proceed to Proxman. Oh. Um. Rutherford. Never mind. Never mind. Paris out. Certainly, Captain. Hail me if you need anything more. Sarcasm. Okay. Uh, we're here. Okay, let's warp. Battle group. So somebody's been directing now the Klingons to attack. Level. What's going on here? This is where the transmission originates. I'm detecting a gravitic distortion in the signal. The signal is passing close to Delta Lyra 3. Ooh. Klingon heavy cruiser decloaded. Oh. 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 Get out of here. Shields have been hit. Proton tubes at 50% efficiency. Yeah, it's not good. Starboard shields down to 50%. Yeah, it's not good. That's Starboard good. shields down to 50%. I know. Forward shields are critical, sir. Let's see what the engines are critical, Captain. I know, everything's getting fucked. Critical, sir. We have a hull breach, Captain. Your ship got hull breach. More shields online. Starboard shields repaired. We need repairs on the track of beach, sir. We need help. Lower shields are critical, sir. Where's the other... We need repairs on the phasers, Captain. More shields online. For a captain to lose his ship is a major blow, I know. During this mission, your ship was lost. That is an automatic failing grade. We'll put you back in the simulator and let you try it again. So perhaps in the real universe, it won't happen to you. Ooh, that shut down. Okay. I think what I need to... Yeah, I think I need to get the other ship with us. Okay, I think I know. Okay, I've had to look up, do a bit of Google search because I was missing something serious here. And apparently, I'm receiving messages from the USS Rutherford and the USS Alexandria. On screen. Yeah, yeah. This yeah, is Captain Brentwood. I know. This I know. Hello, nice to meet you. Apparently, there's a black box floating out Captain. here somewhere. I'm receiving a distress signal from the Telluride freighter Kasdan in the Chancellor system. Okay. They're well, being attacked by a Klingon bird of prey. Course laid in, Captain. No, it's not. I'm going to send these guys. This is Alexandria. Go Proceed. to there. Aye, sir. You can Captain, the USS Alexandria has warped to the Chancellor system. They yeah, should arrive in a few minutes. There should be a black box here somewhere. Hang on. This is wreckage. I think we had to scan the wreckage. No life signs, Captain. The shields were breached only twice. The freighter was destroyed by an engine breach caused when a photon torpedo shattered the right warp nacelle. The shield breach is significant, Captain. The two hull breaches are only two meters apart. The second shot probably went through three decks and exposed the engine core for the photon torpedo shot. Captain, wow. Klingon gunners aren't usually that precise. 
I have found the freighter's computer records container. We should tractor it and decode it. There you go. There you go. All we have to do is scan. Now, that, that there is... is nothing unusual to report, Captain. Okay, where's the decoder? We should tractor it. Wreckage? Black box? Oh, there you go. Tractor beams. T. Object is out of range. Shit. Okay. Captain, the Omega Altair 4 colony reports that it's under attack. Oh, God. Okay, um, hang on a minute. Can you sort that out, will ya? This is Captain Zora. Yeah, yeah, we know who Rutherford, you are. Rutherford, Rutherford, proceed to Omega Altair. Ru the course is being laid now. Your instructions shall be obeyed. Rutherford out. Snoot Captain, the USS Rutherford has warped to the Omega Altair system. I know. They should arrive fun. in a few minutes. Uh -huh. Captain, the Proximan 3 colony reports that it's under attack. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. We've got to get this black Photon box. Photon torpedoes where... are not available, Captain. I know, I know, I know. I'm just trying to find this black box. Oh, there it is. Oh, shit, it's over there. Okay, we didn't need to get this. Trying to crash into it. Can I track to it now? Object is out of range. Okay, I'm at now. I have the freighter's yeah. computer log. Relaying okay. data to Mr. Sturck's station. Interesting. As unlikely as it seems, the Klingon ships that attacked the freighter had no life forms aboard. In addition, only a heavy cruiser and a single bird of prey participated in the attack. There are two birds of prey unaccounted for. Okay. We don't need this anymore, do we? Okay, let's walk to wherever that distress, distress signal came from. This game can be really confusing. If you don't do one little thing, it can completely blow you out of the water. It's got a red alert. <laughs> I nearly forgot about that. <laughs> Wait, you, come here. A Klingon bird of prey has turned oh, away from attacking the freighter and is now heading towards us on an intercept course. Right, can we scan a freighter as well? Let's scan everything. Let's be quick about it. There is nothing unusual to report, Captain. There is nothing unusual to report, Captain. I need to just... Your shields have been hit! Captain, the bird of prey is receiving a faint signal. It matches no known Klingon code. The signal is originating from the Delta Lyra system. Aha, uh -huh. that's... That's what we needed. Now. Forward shields have been hit! Boy, yes, close. Then Forward shields repaired. Now we take this guy down. I think we need to scan him again. Four shields repaired. I did a Google search because I, I just I didn't know about a black box. If you don't know about the black box or scanning a freighter, you can't do anything in this mission. You just get destroyed. There you are. Four shields have been yeah, stick it in your ass. I think I've got a photon in there. Oh, you're here as well. Yeah, I did send you here, didn't I? I thought it was the third system. But no, it's only two systems. Ah, oh, shut up. Where's this bloody Kl uh, Klingon? I don't think there's any Klingons alive on this ship. I think this is a, um... I know, I know. Where is he? Oh, son of a bitch! Yeah, this is a remote-controlled... Remote control bird of prey. Forward shields have been hit. Ooh. I think we need to scan that. Lower shields online. Okay, what's the situation? That's in the red. But according to this. Upper shields repaired. This is okay. I'm gonna sit here for a bit and wait for this to be repaired 100% then. Then we walk to the system. I think we have to talk to the Klingon freighter. This is like the M5 episode from the original Star Trek. Great episode, those. <laughs> okay, let's go. Warp speed. We need to open, I believe we need to open communications as soon as we arrive. If we don't, we can get toasted. Entering Omega Altair system. Okay. Captain, a Klingon bird of prey has decloaked near Omega Altair 4 and is heading towards us. Okay. Like cruiser, hail them. What? They're unwilling to hail? 
Uh, I make a fork and we Most of the colony's communications are down. Oh, I'll continue shit. to monitor it. As long as those signals remain active, we'll know that someone's still alive. Can we help? This is Captain Brentwood of the USS Alexandria. Yeah. We're yeah. at your disposal, Captain. I'll get your ass over here. Return Alexand to the Aye, sir. Captain, the USS Alexandria has warped the Omega Altar system. They should have had Hold on a minute. I don't think this is... The Alexandria reports that it is engaging the Klingons. Okay. Can I get the Rutherford here as well? This is Captain Zor... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh... Rutherford, proceed to the Chancellor's system. Oh, they can't join us. Me. The Get course there. is being laid now. Your instructions shall be obeyed. Rutherford out. I'm sure that's Captain, the, uh, right the USS place. Rutherford has warped to the Chancellor system. That's they should arrive in a few minutes. I'm sure she's going to enjoy that. Yeah, love those torpedoes, don't you? Yeah, yes, sir. Can we quickly scan this guy? Captain, the bird of prey is receiving a faint signal. Okay, it good. matches no known Klingon code. The signal is originating from the Delta Lyra system. Yeah, I guess I'm. Woo! Boom it! Damage report check first. How are we doing? Upper shields online. Okay, let's wait for this to be done first. Okay, fingers crossed. Okay, got green light on the shields. Green light on the shields. I'm gonna send. Can I send the. Where's the Rutherford? This is Captain Zor. Here we know who you are. Return to the. Oh no, I can't send her here. Okay. Rutherford. Rutherford. The course is being laid. Captain, yeah, the USS Rutherford has warped to the Omega Altair system. Okay, they should arrive in a few minutes. Let's go meet M5. Hopefully. Hopefully. I think this is where we have to. Oh, I could have sent it to Proxima. Ah, shit. Okay. Captain, a Klingon bird of prey has decloaked near Proxman 3 and is heading towards us. Hail them. Oh, that's weird. Okay. Have I been lied to? Did light cruiser? Can I hail them? We might need help. This is Captain Zor. We know who you are. Return to the battle group. The course is being laid now. Your instructions. Captain, yeah, we know. The that. USS Rutherford has worked to the proximate system. Okay, we need you. Yeah, we know who you are. Return Alexander. to the battle group. I yeah, sir. Captain, know. the USS Alexandria has worked to the proximate They should arrive in a few minutes. Ah, uh, that's just a bird of prey. Okay, I think we might. The Rutherford just... reports that it is engaging the Klingons. The Alexandria reports that it is engaging the Klingons. Okay. What shields are critical, eh? That's not good. That's not good. Uh, shh. Where are the other starships? They're close by. Okay, we can use them to cover them. I'm trying to crash into them. No, 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 no. Yeah. Let's scan this guy quickly. quickly. Scan. There is nothing unusual to report. Well, great. Let's be dead by now. Come on. Jesus Christ, how tough is this guy? Are we doing any damage? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, you don't crash into him. Okay, stand by. Crystals are realigned, Captain. Warp drives are ready. Don't wait. 
Get scan. Before he dies. Captain, the bird of prey is receiving a faint signal. Got it. It matches no known Klingon code. I've lost it. The signal is originating from the Delta Lyra system. Uh huh. So Delta Lyra, we need to go to Delta Lyra. What the bloody hell is this? Destroyed. Port side shields repaired. We just, shields repaired. We just crashed into each other. We just crashed into each other. We lost the ship. Realigned, Captain. Damn, this guy just one die. Torpedo, what up? The other stud it. Okay, so we just killed the Alexandra. Forward shields online. Forward shields repaired. I wonder if that's going to fail us. I don't know. Would that fail us? We we'll wait for this to go green and hit. Upper shields repaired. It's almost done. What was our mission? Determine the reason for clean activity. Captain, we are descending too far into this planet's gravitational well. Right. Are we? Shit. The bed. Where's the planet? Okay, I'm not sure where the planet is. Can we get the Forward shields repaired? Rutherford. The colony reports no problems, Captain. I know. I know. One, one. This is Captain Zora of the USS Rutherford. Glad we you're await your life. command. Okay, can you go to the... Proceed to the Chancellor system, Delta? Proceed to Omega Altair, Rutherford. Is that where we're going? No, it's the... Proceed to Omega Altair. The course is being laid now. Can you go there. The USS yourself. Rutherford has warped to the Omega Altair system. Okay, they should arrive in a few minutes. Okay. I don't think we need them anyway. I think we're gonna get in trouble for crashing into the other ship. Oh, that's not good. This is where the transmission originates. I'm detecting a gravitic distortion in the signal. The signal is passing close to Delta Lyra Three. Where's Delta Lyra Three? Klingon heavy cruiser decloaking. Lower shield, forward shields down to fifty. Uh, forward shields are critical, sir. That shield system is damaged, Captain. Captain what can I help? Working on it. Hail them. Number three. Lower shields online. Oh shit. This is Captain. Shut up and get here. Rutherford. The course is being laid. Captain Rutherford has warped into the system and is rejoining the group. Okay. Upper shields repaired. Port side shields repaired. Oh Jesus Christ. What kind of hell? Shield system is damaged. Can I help any of them? Oh god, are we can get a bug alert. Oh, that's okay. online. Starboard shields. Now, fingers crossed now entering Delta Lyra, Captain. Good, we're in the right system. Now, can we house This is it? where the transmission originates. I'm detecting a gravitic distortion in the signal. The signal is passing close to Delta Lyra 3. No error messages so far. Let's go to... Klingon heavy cruiser decloaking. Lower, sh lower shields are critical, sir. Uh, I am receiving a response from We've the Klingon it. vessel. That doesn't sound good. Oh, we've got a response, okay. Uh, uh, you attack me without more. Uh, you must. I think we need to compliment him. Yes. Klingon Automated Command Unit 1, I must compliment you on your efficiency. Tell me how you achieved it before you destroy us. Kling, kling, we'll see about that, Klingon Automated Command Unit 1. Klingon, no. Klingon, Klingon. This one. We acquired your M5 computer schematics and Stop built it. a ship to contain it. The brain patterns of a true Klingon warrior are imprinted on my circuits, Captain. Okay. I have the cunning and boldness of the finest Klingon warrior, combined with the abilities of a computer. That doesn't sound good. Uh, Federation of Week, no, I don't want that. Magnificent, you truly are, do you realize? Magnificent? So, you truly are magnificent. Do you realize, Automated Unit 1, ah, that, that if you're successful, Klingon warriors will never need to die in battle again? I think this is what we want. What? You're the ultimate Klingon, Automated Unit 1. 
faster, stronger, without any failing or weakness. When you succeed in your mission of conquest, Klingons will never need to die in battle again, never need to risk themselves in matters of honor, never know the pains that uh, duty and responsibility can bring. Good point. You will create a Klingon utopia. Every Klingon soldier can die an old man, safe in the knowledge that We're an unmatchable that. Klingon will always be around to protect him. Your logic is flawless, yet this cannot be. Forward shield repair. It destroyed itself. Well done, Captain. The ideal Klingon would not deny other Klingons a chance for honor and glory. And it was an ideal Klingon in every way. It was too ideal to live. I suppose I should say <laughs> something about humanity's greatest strengths, sometimes being its weaknesses. Captain, Starfleet reports that all of the ships in the Klingon fleet have just exploded. All of them? The threat to this sector is over. Mission oh. objective complete. Yay! Course laid in, Captain. <laughs> We're definitely sure about that, aren't we? Yes. Take us home. I was a bit worried about that. I thought the game was... I thought the game had a fatal bug then. But we're home. All of us are home. Lower shields repaired. Hmm. Doesn't matter about that. Stop frequency open. We won the war. Mission accomplished, Starfleet. You successfully hey. saved all the colonies, and even took on the M5 computer and won. Congratulations. Fantastic. You did extraordinarily well. I oh, know. It was a nearly flawless mission. Nearly? I have nothing nearly? but praise. But I've never been particularly good with praise. Bless him. Awesome. Okay, I'm definitely going to save that, because that was... <laughs> okay, next week, we shall continue with whatever disasters await us. Until then, I shall bid you adieu. Adios.